Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, where today I'm going to do part 7 to my let's play of Pokemon Omega Ruby from Nintendo 3DS. In the last video, we got pretty far into the game. Near the end of, near, actually at the end of the last video, what we did was we got to Tate and Elias' gym, the 7th gym in the game. We got through it, and we were about to head back out. But since my 3DS was about to die at the time, I couldn't really do that because of the fact that um, my 3DS was going to die and if I went outside the door, it was going to have a cutscene. So I didn't want to do that and be stuck having my 3DS die on me. For this episode, guys, we're going to see if we can try to get through the rest of the game in this episode. I don't know. If we can, the end of the last in this episode might actually be me looking for an axe to you. Because as, as soon as we get through Wallace's gym, I'm flying back to Little Root and going to get that National Pokedex. Or maybe, maybe, maybe even after beating Kyogre and all that, too. I think you actually get after beating Primal Kyogre. I don't know if you have to beat the X Gym or not. I know you have to, to be at least get past Kyogre. Or Groudon, whichever one you're fighting. You have, to pass one, you have to be past them in order to get it. I know that. I don't know if you have to beat the X Gym or not. So what our first cast is going to do once we get to the eight, once we get done with the Kyogre and Groudon, it's going to be flying back to Little Root and getting all that done. So, yeah. But that's how it's going to get Starball growled on growls with us again. Yep. We're in Moss Deep City. Let's go. As you can see, there's probably a cutscene here, so yeah. Yep, see why I didn't do this off camera? Or see why I didn't do this on, in the last episode? Oh my. That's not good. What? 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 Pillar of Light appeared from the sea. That direction. Is that the direction of Route 128? 128, sorry. Come on. Whoa, dude. Seriously, dude. Hey, this is the end of the world. Skitty, don't worry. Calm down. Oh my. Whoa, that was like a total shocker. What the heck was that? That big fat pillar of light. It totally came out of here, didn't it? Hey, Steven. Trenton! I heard from little Lisa and Tate that you visited their gym. I was thinking of trying to catch you while you were in the area, but then this happened. We should talk. Let's go to my place. Did you heal my Pokemon? I need a Pokemon Center as well, dude. I also need a Pokemon Center. I only got one right now. Well, I do, but... Oh, yes. I suppose I should welcome you to my home. Please forgive the rather spirit's decor. Now, where to begin? Well, let's, let's, let us take a moment to understand what is happening to our world right now. That rumbling that shook the earth just now, the ear, eardrum rupture and erup, explosion we heard, they are proof that a seal, which was long hidden deep under sea, has been undone at last. The super ancient Pokemon that has been sealed deep beneath Route 128. And since ancient times, it slept until now in the sea floor cavern. The entrance to that cavern was sealed by the power of a certain Pokemon. All in an effort to keep any human or Pokemon from ever breaching it. But now it appears that the scheming of that terrible team has undone the seal. There is no doubt that they intend to revive the super ancient Pokemon, and once they do so, it seems they hope to make its power their own. Triton, if that team obtain the power of the super ancient Pokemon, it will upset the balance of nature in this world. A crisis unlike any other before it will befall every living thing on this planet. I plan to do everything in my power to quell the situation. That is my duty. But there is a limit to what I can do with my power alone. That is why I am asking for your help. I have great faith in your abilities. 
Lend me your strength to help put a halt to these team's mad ambitions. With you and I, are, uh, with you and I, and our Pokemon all working together, we will overcome this disastrous turn of events. I don't think it is out of the question. I will entrust you with this. Dive. If you use dive, you will be able to dive to the ocean floor with your Pokemon. And take this so you can stay with your Pokemon even in the depths of the ocean. Devin Scoopy Gear. If you were to use dive in the correct stretch of water along Route 128, I believe you should be able to reach the entrance to the C4 Cavern. I will join you when I finish my duties. Please do what you can to stop Team Ma Aqua and Team Magma until then. I'm trusting you to do this for me. Yes sir, Steven. I hear you, bud. Did you heal my Pokemon though? He healed my Pokemon! No he didn't. Swanbird still got 192 health. He, ha he has 198 in total. Oh crap. Oh well, I need to heal at least the power points of the mage anyway. If you were to use- oh yeah. Maybe I'll put one healed first. Oh, that was his house! I didn't realize whose house that was. No one was in it last time we looked in it. Okay, so that really confused me. I gotta go in here right now. Hey, Nurse Joy. Will you use your very sweet heart and heal my Pokemon, please? Thank you, ma'am. One, two, three, four, five. Do -do 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 -do. First things first, we gotta find some water, so we gotta go. Oh, there you go, we found water. <laughs> I'm like, well, actually, is this the right stretch of water we need, though? I thought there's like another part of the beach we could go to. Aha, I think we just found it. Alright, Swampert, let's, let's, let's do this. I think it's this way. I think we're heading in the right direction. No, we're not. Oh, wait. No, we're not, because this camp. Oh my gosh! There might be a path on the right, wait a minute. Tentacle, you ugly piece of crap, I'm trying to do something here. See, how else can I get to the right side? There's a path down here, I think. Uh, not this one that I need to go. Continue. Never mind. Is that what, wait a minute. Can I see the map? There we go. Let me see the map. It says down to the south. How in the world? That's Route 127 anyway, but... Oh gosh, how did I do this before? Oh, wait a minute. This probably won't work either, but there's rocks blocking the way like there's a path of secret over here. Oh, there is. Okay. Okay, I was getting myself lost there. Well, we found some trainers. Let's battle them while we're going on to where we need to go. Through fishing, I have attained a state of become centrality. Please, allow me to demonstrate. I am challenged by fisherman Jonah. All right, Swapper, let's go. Swampert, use Rock Slide. Hmm. 
Well, I can't. Rock. Airport rock. Grass would be good. I don't think I have any grass to match. Alright, come back, Swamper. You did great. Sparky, let's go! Sparky, use Wild Charge. That was recorded, that was recorded you too, idiot. It didn't take him out though, of course. Use Quick Attack. Boom. What is your level 45? There we go. Though I've lost, my heart remains calm. It matters not that I catch nothing. The line remains in the water. Route 1 2 at Moss Deep City up. Uh, Route 1 2 8 down there. Oh. Bird Pokemon have excellent vision. They spot prey from great heights. Do, 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 do. I am challenged by Bird Keeper Brian. Alright, Brian. Sorry. Do Trio. Go Swampert. You have a rock type move, which is really good against flying. He. Use Rot Slide. Swamper Girl level 61. He's almost at level 100 and we haven't got anywhere. We haven't got to the post game. He's almost at level 100. He's only 39 levels away. Keep going. Hey, Zatu. Take this rock slide. Goodbye. Square girl 48. Charge! It might be better. Oh, wait, never mind. Charge is just one of the moves that charges up, but up certain moves, right? Use your boost of power over the electric move it uses on the next turn. It's also raised the boost special defense stat. Yep. I need a better water. I need a better water. I have Volt Switch, but at the same time, I could be. Can I teach a Volt Switch? I probably could. Hell, I give up. There are lots of diving spots in the sea around here. You can spot them easily from the sky because of their darker color. How much power does Volt Switch have? There it is. Seventy. Dang it. I always keep wild charge. As dangerous as it is, I really need... Man, I'll just learn one on his own. I need, I need something better than wild... Wild charge is good, but it does too much recoil. Hello. Well, hey, this is a match between a Pokemon fan and a fishing buff. I am challenged by Fishman Roger. Let's go, Swampert. Take my earthquake. Sharpedo. Sparky, let's go. Come back, Swampert. And come on out, Sparky. Sparky, 
Use Wild Charge, as dangerous as that could be, because he's going to do recoil and the uh, recoil and rough skin. Right? Yep. Uh, I hope it's not do too much recoil. Oh my. That just sucks. Okay. No! My lines are tangled! The party's over! My fishing line's doing a dance! The tango tang the tangle tango! <laughs> it's actually kinda of funny, ain't gonna lie. Hello. Whoops! Don't tell me I snagged the surfing Pokemon! I am challenged by Fisherman Henry. Let's go, Swampert. Swampert's amazing. I love him to death. He's, like, really strong, too. He's, like, impressing me really well, too. Right slide. Like, watch. This attack probably won't be very effective. Watch we'll knock it out. One shot or almost one shot. Boom. And I think Swampert's probably even more strong than Grovall, because I ain't, I mean, Sceptile. But I don't know. Please go for a nine. I can't keep up! Your Pokemon look pretty strong. They'd be a handful to hook them. A Zinc. A random Zinc just sitting right here. I want to tell everything, so don't blame if I go like looking for all the trainers. I like battling trainers; they're fun to battle. It's probably one of my favorite things about this game in general is the fact that you can battle trainers or battle people. Oh. I'm wearing my swimsuit under my shirt. This shirt makes it plain that I'm an ace trainer. I am challenged by ace trainer Cordelia. Or Claudia, I didn't say say it. Oh crap. Go Swampert. What's he good against ice? I think this thing's... Use Rock Slide. You are protect, you idiot! Suffer! I rock so I pain. Oh, it is super fat. Okay, good, good, good. Rock versus Austin also, also be very good, so. Okay. Masquerade. <laughs> Alright, Masquerade. Are you ready to feel my pain? Why did I have to rhyme? Use rot slide. Boom. Barking Grid all fifty two. Dust claws. Oh no. I want to just keep going. Screw it. Use Earthquake or the thing part goes. Oh no, my ain't it works. Here we go. Dagum, you burning me? I don't have any burn heels. I bet I have ice heels. I know that's a pick up in that one. Goodness gracious, it does a lot. Um, use Take Down. Oh yeah, it's normal! What am I, I mean, what am I thinking? I was trying to do the thing that took out the quickest and I didn't even think about... Oh, thank you for getting rid of that. Use Surf. Wait, what did it say it did? What did it say? Stop doing that! This is so bad. Sir, oh, it cleared the burn. I don't know why I'm thinking about the confusion. Thank you. Whoa. 
Water splashed on me. Oh no, my shirt is soaked. Now I just transform into a swimmer. That'd be kind of hilarious, I wouldn't lie. I bought some burn heels. If I, if I don't, I have some berries that do it. Uh, full heel, I have two of those. Okay. There we go. He's cleared from his burn. Sir? Ice trainers can even appear in the sea. Yes, even those who can't swim. I am challenged by ace trainer Hitasho. Dude. Pincer. Ghost Swampert. Don't know why I keep saying it that way. Ghost Swampert. So go Swampert or something. Swampert, surf. Haven't used that mask on that much, but ain't many pole on each side right now. Does it really matter? I wait there's like three or four pole on each side, then maybe I'll think about using it at least once. I'm gonna fall in! Whoa! I was just about to fall off my Pokemon! It's not easy being an ace trainer. I wanna I wanna check out these things, but first let me I wanna check out these dial spots in a minute. Oh yeah, teach up one dive anyway. But first let me battle everybody here. Hello. Ah, uh, I want to teach up on dive too, so I need to figure out who I'm gonna teach it to. I got flash and fly on Pelipper. I mean, Pelipper. I got flash and fly on Latios. And if I and I don't want to teach this one because he already knows what type move. I don't think I can get rid of Surf. Well, I can't get rid of Surf. I don't want to be swimming on water. Are there any drowning Pokemon or trainers here? I've taken it upon myself to go on swim patrol. I am challenged by Trithalite Jalen. Swampert, time to kick some butt, my friend. I love Swampert to death. He's probably, I wouldn't say better than Sceptile, but that's definitely, he's definitely my second favorite, and he always will be. Second favorite in the Hoenn region, anyway. Rock slide it. Swamper to 62. Lottie's girl 46. Power split. I don't know what that move is. No. Why did the mood to be nice? What? Why? I think I might drown. You were on swim patrol, dude, really? I'd rather be a lifeguard than an athlete. It sounds cooler, right? Tentacool, I, I swear if I didn't want to catch an axe later in the game, I would like get rid of all of you by using repels. I don't want to, I don't want, I'll be using all my money on revolves and all that for the po Pokemon League if I ever make it there. Which I probably, I might. Thanks to Topless is a place we don't have to show up to yet. I think this is the place to suit, I think this is the way to suit Topless, I ain't gonna worry about it. But who can I teach dive? Why is Oh, why is the other one learning it other than Swampert? Wadios is basically an HM sway for this team. You know the move 
Fly and Flash. If I get to the mood where I'm deleting Flash when I get the chance. Just forget. Just forget Heal Pulse. I shouldn't have did this, but I need somebody to know he's dodged so I can't even get anywhere in the game. I think I found a stretch. Yeah, there's the ocean. Let's dive in other places first. See what's down there. It might be something secret. Let's do this. Target sighted. I'll take him down. All right. I am challenged by scuba diver Javar. Let's go, Swampert. I love that little animation where the pole like slowly floats instead of just like flies randomly. That's kind of cool. You surf. I feel like swimming down to the depths. I'm so embarrassed. What's up here then? Nothing. I channel everything, guys. You can't blame me. I like to check out everything to make sure. I heard like a bing sound. Oh! Oh, a, um. Yeah! He's, um. Crap. Alright, who it is? Chimchow. Chimchow. I was kind of thinking that. So I was thinking Chimchow. I was in Chimchow and Chimchow. Kind of mixed together there. I think we found it. I think this is it right here. Before we go in there, though, it's my shirt. I think we found it, guys. We found it. We found a C4 cavern. All right, Team Magma, I'm coming for you, twerps. You're not messing up this point. I'm not. You're not gonna do anything to the world. I'm coming. Don't know why that came out. Yep, oh, that's a submarine. Submarine explorer won his pan on the hull. It seems to be the submarine team magma stole from the shipyard in Slateport. Guys, we're about to go to bow team magma, it looks like. Because we have to in order to get to Kyogre. If there's a random dumb Pokemon here, I'm going to see repeat off. Hey, a hardstone. I remember my bike in here, that'd be great actually if I could. I couldn't. Oh, I need to move strength! Oh! Don't tell me. I hope I hope somebody other than Swapper and um Wadis can learn it, because otherwise this is gonna be bad. I don't like teaching them everything, so why I need a better HM site? The problem is my phone couldn't learn to move cut. To the fact that like stuff like this kept happening. Sir Strength. Mariana. Manetric. I am an intric and orange. Huh. Does that does, does quick attack have bear power? Wow, strength has a better than. Well, let's just replace quick attack for strength then because it has better power. 
It ain't the best, but it's better than... There we go. Now I have somebody with no strength as well, and it ain't really an HM slave. There's gonna be a Geodude here, watch. Dang, I was right! It's a Graveler! That's the evolved form! Oh no, never mind. I'm running. Well, actually, I could take you out with one fellow's water thing. But I ain't gonna do it. I want you to go be if you leave me alone. Leave me alone, I let you go. So leave me alone, I let you go. Leave me alone. Huh? What? When did I teach him strength? I forgot about that. Once I remember where the move doyer is, I'm daggum gonna do this. Once the move doyer, once I find the move doyer again, what town was he? I think he was like in Lilico, wasn't he? I'm teaching him. I'm going to him. There he is. Hey, Team Magma. I have no use for children. Go on. Get out of here. I am challenged by a Team Magma grunt. Numo. Alright, Swampert. Let's go. You surf. Boom. Mighty Inna. Alright. Mighty Inna. I mean, no. Swamper, use Rot Slide. Use Tape Down. There we go. I want to go home. You were just complaining about me being there, and then you want to go home now? In the end, I was just an opponent for a kid in a Pokemon battle. Go back, I'm going to, I'm going to rip your wings off and say, I'm not going to deal with this like I was the last time. I'm not dealing with this. I'll just rip your wings off and make sure you leave me alone. Bye. I have a rock slide move. I'm, I'm I almost out of power punch for that move though. That sucks. The submarine is so small and cramped. Wait, I have a phone up to the girl. Sorry. The submarine is so small and cramped that it makes your body hurt. But I don't mind it. My suspicion was wrong. I'm challenged by Team Madman Grunt. Oh, hello, Swampert. Let's show this thing a little piece of. Let's show this little piece of crap a lesson for annoying me a while ago. Use Rock Slide. Your own. Your last one. <laughs> Goodbye, go about you and piece of crap. Spargo 49. There we go. It hurts when you lose. I don't mind that either, though. Rolling in the submarine, we s riding in the submarine we stole is the best. It's just wonderful that it's so cramped. He's a little bit weird. There's too many pathways. I want y'all everything. That one's a puzzle. <gasps> Go back. Here's his wings, guys. <sighs> if you don't stop annoying me. Go away before I rip your wings off. I mean it. 
I about physically will rip your wings if you don't leave me the crap alone. Battle me. Hey, hey, hey! Fanning out has helped in spotting a suspicious person. I am challenged by a Team Magma grunt. Hi, Numo. Alright, Swampert. Let's do this, my friend. Show them what you're well, show them what you're made of. Me and Swampert are being perfect sync. Surf on it. Bye. Fanning out has nothing at all to do with winning Pokemon battles. You should just keep going straight. I'm sure it'll be a riot. Tee hee hee. I'll do that after I check out the other path for real, because that's that might be the right that might, the way I just went might be the right way. So I'm going to check out. This is a faster way for me to get around. You can't blame for an easy fight. A lot more. It's a lot faster. It's a lot easier than running on me, cause I I ain't covering up the screen. I mean, it's kind of covering up the screen, but like it's better than like what would happen if I didn't use it. I can't believe this thing new. I can we grab the new strength. I'm going to murder. Go away, you idiot. Ay, 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 ay. Sakura Blue, I swear if I could use her pills, I so would. Because I did not want I didn't, I want to catch an axe so no matter what, I'm not using my repels. This is really annoying. That's the way we're supposed to go. Fine. Okay. I'm going the way that way was wanting me to. Or, like, trickingly, trickingly wanting me to. Where the heck am I? This is the opposite I want to do. Wait. Ah! I got myself lost, actually. Is there a second pathway? Yeah, there is. Okay. I thought I got myself lost here. Go back, I swear, I'm ready to come on the screen physically and really, like, beat you instead of, like, getting my opponent into it. I'll do it myself. Because I... Ay, ay, ay. I don't want this whole episode to be Pokemon wild, wild Pokemon battles. I really don't want this whole episode to be that. Oh, if it's... Trainer battles are important battles like we're having. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Yeah, I keep reading that they keep that. What is this? Oh. What an annoying kid to follow us to be to the bottom of the ocean. That all ends now, though. Another annoying kid. And how dare you call me that? Team Mamma? Oh, it's a girl. A girl just called me annoying. How dare you? You are very rude now, must suffer my consequential pain. Alright, Swampert, let's teach this lady a lesson. <laughs> Swampert. Oh, this thing has a levitate, I was about to say, don't, I was about, I was about to tell it to use Earthquake, but he knows what levitate, so I ain't gonna risk it. Surf. Wait, not even risk it, like, he, we know we're gonna hit if it has levitate. Boom. You do it that way. Now, what'd you tell me about, now, what'd you tell me about being annoying? 
The boys go over 50. What an annoyance! Even the way you fight is just oozing with an unnoxiousness. She's calling me annoying. That's basically the basis of her. It doesn't matter how hard you try, anyway. By now, Leader Maxius. <laughs> ah! I think, I think this is the place we were before, though. Oh, yeah, yeah, back in that tunnel I just passed, and then I got to, um. I think I got back in that, I think I got back in that tunnel I was just passed, and now I take me back to that room with all them blocks to push around, and now I go back to the cave with the water in it. Okay, so I have a plan in, yep, right here. There we go. Yep. I mean, what going? It ain't this one, is it? No. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. Go back. I don't feel like it's this one either. Oh, dang it. Never mind. This was a big old circle back to the beginning. Okay, we gotta go in this tunnel. I think that was like a different edge. Yeah, this is the right way to, This is the one we need to be in. We need to go this way. And it's this tunnel up here. This one. Yep, here we are. Alright, let's use Surf and get through this puzzle. Let's think. If I go in this one with that... I made it! That puzzle wasn't that hard. Oh, it's a pawn high. I ain't gonna worry about it. Screw that. Well, if it, if it ain't, you can't see it right now, so I don't care. Alright, camera up. Tell me what strength, please. Ooh, wait a minute. There we go. Ah! Go, but why is it all you? I, I seriously when Barry taking one to go rip him off. Maybe his fan, friends and family were gonna stop then. Like he's getting annoying. He's like really annoying me now. Oh hello. Who are you? How did you get in here? Uh hello. I'm the kid that's annoying you to death. And how I got in here? Well, I followed you to the bottom of the ocean. So yeah, that's how I did all this stuff you're asking me. I uh, okay, Swampert, let's do this. Although if I have an ether, I might give it too much of this battle because I need to get that rock side move back. I almost have everything but takedown. Use Earthquake. A critical. Goodbye. A wheezing. You sir. Swamper could do over 63. Hammer arm! He can learn to move hammer arm? What? He can learn a fighting type move! No way! A power of 100. The user swings and hits with its strong and heavy fist. It lowers the user's speed, however. Oh. Who cares? That's way better than takedown! Give it a takedown right now! Now he's doing a fighting type move, a rock type move, a water type move, and a ground type move. He knows four different kinds of moves. Ooh, yeah. Go, Swampert. I love Swampert to death now, definitely. There we go. That was a total and complete loss. 
I don't know where the exit is. I'm not scared though. Don't get me wrong. Do I have a mass ether in here? Please tell me I do. I have an ether. I have one to a single move. Oop! I didn't mean to do that. Um, right side. There we go. Hey, we have a mass ether. I'll save those though, since I already put rock side back on. I might need to use that one a little bit. Let's push this a lot. I keep forgetting he already can. There we go. Oh boy, it's a it's a it's a puzzle. I don't like puzzles. Puzzles suck. Come like puzzles suck. Get off this so I can see what I'm doing. Hmm. I've got to move one of those. Goba, I swear to you, if I could rip your wings off, I'm gonna do it, because I. <laughs> oh, this thing's gonna turn me. Er, this Goba can turn me into a madman. I can't see the puzzle when you're doing this, you idiot! I wish I had some good repels. Do I have just a single repel? Like, I don't, even, I don't even mean like a super repel, but do I have a repel in general? If I do, I might use it right now because I'm about to rip these. I'm about really to ready to go into the screen, take both their wings, rip them off, throw them in the trash, and then. I don't know. Please, for the love of Trenton, tell me I have some of these repels. Cause they're unknown. I'm about ready to do what I'm thinking of doing right now. Oh, please have one. Please have one. Please have one. Of course I. Wait a minute. One more place. Come on. Matt's repel. But I only have our super repel. I'm gonna use a super pill right now. Screw it. I'll save the max of power for while I wanna catch you at sea. If I need more, I can easily just buy more. You know? I don't I can easily just sell Yeah. Now I, I mean if I want more, I can easily just sell stuff for money and get more money after the post when the post game starts or something like that, so no need to worry. I did something wrong here. I hate these. I don't. I'm trying to think. I have a feeling you gotta do something with one of these sides. I don't remember what it is. Is it this? Like move this one to the right? All right, move one of these. Move this one to the right. And move these up. Nope, because it won't push that one. Oh, wait a minute. Can I push this one down? I can. There we go. You too, remember, I found it. Alright, I made it through that puzzle. Thank goodness. That's like, one of the more annoying things. I see lava. Lava. That's not a good thing, is it? Ooh. Earthquake! I've already got one before knowing that, so who cares? Alright, let's go in here. Uh oh! Yep, it's Archie and Matsy! <laughs> How pathetic you appear now! The fool, Archie! <laughs> Maxi, you! Uh oh! Hello, Maxi and Archie! How are you all? What are you doing over here? 
<laughs> Just as I predicted. Uh, we'll scare. Even I, the great Maxi, have found myself wishing for something I cannot justify. And the illogical desire that I harbored was to have you present at this moment. <laughs> and now that fool's wish has come true. Fantastic. Nothing could please me more. I suppose I should make introductions. I present to you my incomparable partner, who will assist Team Magma in driving humanity forward to its next level. The Super Ancient Pokemon? Groudon! Oh no. Behold! This great form slumbering in defiance of even the brewing la boiling lava surrounding it. So long have I been waiting for this day. In summary long, this foolish world has held back humanity's progress out of misguided idolism regarding the co coexistence of humans and Pokemon. But this ancient creature can bring that to its rightful end, creating a new land upon which humanity may stride freely forward. Now that I have at last obtained the power of Primal Groudon! And now, you are the final obstacle to be remain between me and my goals. It behaves me to use every tool at my disposal to eliminate you. Indeed, even Mega Evolution. Do not delude yourself that you and your Pokemon are the only ones capable of it. I must apologize for making you wait through our encounters at Mount Chimney and Mount Pyre without treating you to the sight. Brace yourself for my ultimate attack! <laughs> uh oh. I am challenged by the Team Aqua. Uh, no, not Team Aqua. Team Maxi. Thank you, Team Maxi! Team Magma Leader Maxi. I have Mega Evolution 2. Don't forget that, sir. And guess what? I might go and use it right now since you'll have them. Um, I remember his Mega, Mega Evolve Pokemon. So you know what I'm going to do? Swampert, Mega Evolve, and use Earthquake. <laughs> Mega Swampert once again. I've only seen him twice. Or once. The last time. Oh yes. Mega Swampert, friends. Use Earthquake. Weezing. Oh god. Just keep going. We can easily take out Weezing. Why are you saying that it destroys the crap out of my face? You surf. Why am I just one shot in this Pokemon? Good thing I used my Swampert. Crobat. Aha! Rock Slide! Use Rock Slide! Swampert is just one shot in his Pokemon like they're nothing. I love Swampert to death right now. Why is level 47? Uh oh, Camera Rupt. It's time for his Mega Evolved Pokemon. He's gonna have a Mega Camera Rupt. I have a Mega Swampert. Battle time, friend. Let's surf on it. Here it comes. Yep. Hi, Camera Rupt. How are you today, friend? Hmm. <laughs> You surf! We just one shot his mega camera up! <laughs> yes! I love Swarmer so much! This is so great! We just defeated his always pull on one shot! You're really done it, child! You've shown a power that exceeds that of the great Maxi! I just one shot all his Pokemon. I know a Mega Evolve 2, but it's like the safest bet for us. Huh? Huh? <laughs> what is wrong? <laughs> what is wrong with this dude? <laughs> what is wrong with him? Splendid! 
just splendid, my young trainer. No, it's more than that. I should be calling you my young hero. Believing until the very end that a world where humanity and Pokemon coexist may be the best. Rejecting my idols without a second thought. Yes, watching you struggle desperately to halt the beginning of the world's end. You are undoubtedly a hero. So noble. And yet, I will not yield. I will not bend. My ideals will not be shaken. My dream for the world's next step forward will never change. I will use the red orb to awaken Groudon, revert to its primal form, and put into all outs. Wait, Maxie! Was that, was that, oh, it's, it, is that, oh gosh. No, two voices sound too much alike. But, Tabitha? Do stop that now, please, Maxie. I'm sorry I changed up his voice a lot, but burning it sound too much alike. Okay, just deal with it. You just don't understand. What Groudon will bring about upon awakening is an end to the world. Huh. Did you think I had not noticed? That I had somehow failed to realize you were after my spot? Such a sad development indeed. To be betrayed by my number two. In the end, there is only one being upon which I can depend. Now, Groudon. I absorb all of the power resting in this red orb and reclaim yourself. Revert to your primal form. This is the time to take back the great evolution you lost in the ancient past. Reclaim the possibility you once held. Uh-oh! <coughs> you! You are crazy. Actually, both of them are crazy if you think about it. Both of them are seriously crazy because both we... Uh, in t in out of the Sapphire, um, Archie was the one crazy. And now in this game, Maxie's the one that's crazy. It's like, either way, they're both crazy. What are you thinking, Maxie? Oh, good God! Hi, Groudon. You wanna be friends? Um, hi, hi, I'm right here. Yeah, hi, um, hi, yes, I'm right there. Um, can you, um, yeah, hi. <laughs> I'm, like, nervous. Oh, gosh. That is not good. What'd you do this for, Maxie, you crazy lunatic? Now Groudon's loose upon the world here. This ain't good. You are crazy! Hey, Maxie, you're crazy. Let me tell you that now. You are crazy. Well, of course, Ma or, uh, Archie was in the other game, so you can't blame just Maxie. He wasn't. He wasn't crazy in the other game. Not as crazy as he's in this one. <laughs> at last, at last, I finally done it. A new world for human evolution will be born. We shall stride forward. What have you done? Boss, what? Uh-oh. Hmm? A message from our members outside. What is it? The sun, the sun has turned mercilessly fierce in its heat. I should expect so. That is what I have long... No, what we have long wished for. What? The heat is greater than simulations predicted. It will be a risk to our own safety if it continues. That cannot be. It has only just awoken. Where is it getting so much power from? And how much more will it gain when it doesn't undergo primal reversion? C continue your readings, then report back. Boss, Maxi, just what's happening on the surface? All that matters is that I have used the red orb to awaken Groudon. And now, I will transform this planet to a land ideal for humanity. Hey, Maxie. Looks like we underestimated the power of the super ancient Pokemon. The power of primal reversion. What did you say? Primal Groudon brings about an end. Alright, but you don't get to choose which end. 
It's going to drop every living thing on this planet to its death. The only thing waiting for us is despair. A despair we can't even run from. A despair we can't even... Uh, a despair that's going to crush humanity. You blasted fool! And it's all happening because you were cocky enough to think you could control the super ancient Pokemon's power. So the information we received from the Weather Institute was true. Boss Maxi. We'll never get anywhere just standing around here like this. There isn't a moment to spare. We must confirm the situation on the outside. Child, you're coming too. Hurry up! You demanding little brat. Good job, Maxi. What have you done to the world? Ooh, gosh. I'd hate to be outside in that heat. Oh, my. That's... This is not... What? I... I wanted... I wanted to make... It was supposed to be a world where the human race would attain new heights. The next stage of our development. It was all for humanity's future. Yeah, and trying to pretty much kill off everybody else. By do to do that. Boss. Maxi. So this is the power of the super ancient Pokemon. This is how Groudon brings everything to an end. All of us. People in Pokemon. Every living thing on this planet. Everything's gonna die. Okay, little scamp. We're setting sail for Cetopolis. That blasted ground is no doubt going to get there ahead of us. It'll be waiting for us deep in the Cave of Origin there in Cetopolis. There's a pool of energy there that folks say is needful for primal reversion. There's no doubt in my mind that Groudon will be racing to that cave, thirsting for that power. We got no choice but to go ourselves. We gotta do whatever we can to fight back. Alright, Maxi. You two magma blighters better come with us. We're responsible for this mess. This ridiculous, impossible mess. It only makes sense for us all to step up and clean up after ourselves. Agreed? Huh. Let's go, Boss Maxi. Hey, little scamp. Look, I'm supposed to be a grown up, right? So let me say sorry for the way this has gone down. And I'm sorry because I've got to ask you to pitch in with the cleanup. We need every hand on deck if we're going to do something about this mess. So, I'll be waiting for you in Cetopolis. Thanks, Matsy. You caused it. You're going to bring the world to an end because of your actions. Of course, like I said, all you did the same thing in Alpha Sapphire, so I can't pin it on anybody now because both of them did it in one game or another. It's just in one game, the other person, in one game, Archie's the good guy, in another game, Archie's the bad guy, and the same thing with Maxie. In one game, Archie's like a, not really a bad guy as much, and, um, in the other game, he's a really bad guy and all that. Triton, I'm sorry I could not be here sooner. Terrible. So this is what was being depicted in that painting in Granite Cave. If this doesn't stop, I'll hoe him. No, the entire world will burn up. Nothing could live in such a land of death. Neither Pokemon nor humans. This dreadful blaze, it must be caused by the sweltering heat wave forming above Sutopolis. Come on, Steven, think. What are you going to do? No, there's no point in agonizing over the situation from here. I have to go to Sutopolis. There must be answers there. Triton, I will count on you to help with this crisis, but please, promise you won't do anything reckless. Well then, I'll go ahead to Cetopolis. Good luck to you. Bye, Steven. I've got to swim all the way to Cetopolis. What did you do, Maxie? We'll get the... I mean, just look. What the feces, Maxie? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? No, what is wrong with me? <laughs> I know there was a left path somewhere. I don't know where it is. Is it over here? 
Yep, right here. Okay, I think this is the right path. So now we'll battle them trans we didn't battle a while ago. So we had to head over here anyway. We better as well not have done it. Before I do, let's see what's under here. Oh, Chin Chow, hello. Oh, you're a trainer, aren't you? I am challenged by Free Diver Jalan. Let's go, Swampert. Swampert, use hammer arm. Oh, yeah, it makes me slower. You are an idiot. That just powers up my war type moves. All right, you surf. You can't skin dive, can you? Skin dive. It's possible to dive even if you can't swim. I'm challenged by Scuba Diver, Scuba Diver Tristan. All right, Scuba, 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 Scuba Diver Tristan. Use rock slide. Eek. Surf. It ain't gonna do much, but it'll be enough to pick it out. Boys go over 51. Spark go over 50. Diving is easy. You just have to sink. I'd like to go up to see Topless now. Hello, kiddo! What a battle with me! I am challenged by swimmer girl Brenda. Let's go, Swamper. Uh oh, that's actually bad. Swampert, use Earthquake. There we go. Is this too topless? It ain't telling me. Oh! This towering white mountain of rock is too city! I was asked whether it was too topless, and it was like, This is white mountain is too topless. Like, thank you for answering my question. I'm challenged by swimmer boy Dean. Alright, 
Alright, Swampert, time to kick some serious butt, friend. Use Rock Slide. Swampert grew to level 64. Golduck. Ooh, a Golduck. Ooh. Let's switch to Sparky, though. No, Sparky's too old in health. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. Just keep going, just keep going. Never mind, never mind. That was a bad idea. I was about to... <laughs> Poor one was old in health. That wouldn't have worked out very well. Just... Rot side. Looks like Rot side's working pretty well, despite not being very effective. Star you. Alright, keep going. Use hammer arm. There we go, Barry Girl 54, undefeated swimmer boy Dean. Have I been beaten? I can't find the entrance to Sutopolis. Where could it be? Oh, it's probably a die spot in here. Yep, I remember this. There's a die spot in here. I just gotta find the die spot that has it. Yep. Let's find the die spot. There's a die spot right here, but I don't know if it's the right one. There's a die spot that you need to get to see top with, so I know that. I just found I see something over there. Screw the butt. Oop. Oh, come on! Chin Chow, you ugly piece of crap. Well, not ugly, but still, get out of here. It's ugly, but, or not still. Ugly, but not ugly. Get the heck out of here. That was not ugly. Dang it. Oh, there it is. Let's get into Sutopolis. That's where we need to be. Sutopolis City. We made it. We gotta find the entrance. Or I found the entrance. Yep. Hey, good. Oh, this is the Pokemon Gym. I can't even take it on yet. I remember that. Sutopolis City Pokemon Gym, Leader Wallace, artist and lover of water. Doors closed. I need to find a Pokemon Center first, that's my first main goal. Pokemon Center, Nice joy! Sutopolis City, the mystical city where history slumbers. Aha, I found it! Nurse joy, can you help me? Hey, Nurse Joey, how are you today, babe? One, two, three, four, five. Now I'm pulling a ray for action again, and they have all the stuff back. Okay. Hello, miss. I don't know why, but I'm really scared. Mm, I think I'll watch some bad buzz never calm myself down. That might be worse. They might be talking about what's going on in the world right now at the time. The whole town has taken refuge, and now I will leave their home. This weather, could it be the prelude to something? People were mentioning an old legend or something. Since I probably can't go inside, yeah, I can't go inside people's home. We're going out to dad gum. Find where I need to go.
I ain't got time for these junk wads. Magic carp you. Magic carp, if you're excuse me, I'm trying to save the world here. Now go away before I hurl you across the water. I'm getting annoyed with you, junk wads. The crap face, dumb craps, wads, dumb crap faces. I only see one entrance. I'm asking to go from Lost's gym over there. I don't know. Oh no, I see an extra staircase right here. An extra place right here, anyway. Yep. Hey, yep, there we are. Trenton, so you did come. I've been waiting for you. What terrible heat. I feel as though the entire world would burn away. Oh, yes. You need to hear what my friend has to say. My name is Wallace. I'm this town's gym leader. I've also been entrusted with the protection of the Cave of Origin. This drought is being caused by, by power emitting from the Cave of Origin. That is the blue orb. I see. Follow me. Okay. The sunlight. People in Pokemon need sunlight to live. So why does the sunlight fill us with so much dread? The blazing sun over Sutopolis is growing even more intense. Soon all of Hoenn will be caught under its withering glare. If that were to happen... Up, oh, it's Team Magma and all them junks. Hey, Maxi, why did you do this? Team Magma and Team Aqua. We've been waiting for you, scamp. Leader Maxi, to the ch to that child. I know what must be done. I won't trust this to you now. It is the fruit of our collaboration with the Devon Corporation, and it re represents the heat height of Hoenn's technological knowledge, knowledge and skill. I attained the magma suit! Hey! We had actually been preparing that in anticipation of making contact with Groudon, but at this point it doesn't look like there's any hope of that for us. There's nothing we can do except leave it to you. And yet, even with the magma suit, is it possible that anyone could pass through that magma? Now fiercer than ever due to the force of nature? That's true. It is very possible that its energy could be far greater than our calculations show. There's nothing to fear. The blue RP bears. Its ancient powers protect both the boy and his Pokemon. You've hit the nail on the head. Those old folks in Mount Pyre did say something about that. That the Red Orb would unleash Groudon's primal powers and trigger a primal reversion, while the Blue Orb had the power to reverse that and calm the beast. Yes, the energy overflowing from the Cave of Origin just now. It is the same energy that gives Groudon its power. I'm sorry for changing this voice, but just deal with it, please. With the blue orb, which contains the power to suppress that, it should be possible to calm the rage of this flood of magma. Of course, the blue orb's power alone will not lead you to where Groudon waits. You will not reach Hoenn's core that way. Use the suit that you were just given. With that, it will finally become possible to stand up against the force of nature. Triton, to think that you had the blue orb. You'll be okay. You and your Pokemon can handle whatever happens. I'll believe that. No man or woman from Sutopolis is permitted to enter the Cave of Origin, but you must go, together with your blue orb. You must go regardless of what waits for you inside that cave. 
We'll also get our people together up top here to help any folks in Pokemon in trouble. My little scamp of a savior. Looks like we've been making you bear at the burden of on your little shoulders alone. I'm sorry for that. But I know you're going to see this through. Child. You. No. I have no right to call you child. Fellow trainer. I have caused great harm. And for that. I apologize most sincerely. I'll forgive you, but you better not do this. Well, he's probably going to do this crap again, actually. But now we find ourselves at an impasse. And you and your Pokemon are all that humanity has to count on in its stand against Groudon. Mm -mm. The fate of our world. The world upon which all humanity thrives. The fate of our world rests in your hands. That's probably not a good thing, actually. May? It's May. Trin! I heard on the news that things were going haywire around Cetopolis. And then I saw you on buzz, buzz now, Trin. I couldn't sit there and do nothing when I knew you were here in the thick of it. So I came flying. I go into the cave of origin. This is gonna be fun. Let's talk to everybody first. Hello, Team Magma. I mean, Aqua. We'll also get our people together. Hello. Alright, now is the time for us to carve out a new future with our scientific prowess. For the pride of Team Magma, we will struggle ferociously. Where did you come from? The legend told by the old man on Mount Pyre. It wasn't a made-up story after all. The natural balance of things is going through a wretched shift here in Hoenn. You alone must go. You and your blue orb. We're going to go in, go in now. Let's go into the Kale Origin, guys. We're going to have to battle ground on. After you tell we don't even have to, because we could literally just, um, use that Master Ball we caught. Or got. Not caught. We haven't caught a Master Ball. Oh! Oh, God. Here we go with the Wingle again. I mean, I'm calling them Wingle because I want to rip their wings off now. I guess because Wingle has the name Wing in it. Oh yeah, I need a poke in. You... Crap hole! Mawa, you ugly piece of crap! Not ugly, but I'm getting tired of seeing all these Pokemon that are just driving me mad. Can I just get to dig and growl on like a man, please? Like a man, yes. Uh-oh. You know what? I wanna be the very best like no one ever was. Do, 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 do. The cast them is my real test. The train them is my cars. Bye. I wanted to do that just to entertain myself now. So this is gonna annoy me to death. Hi, grow up. That ain't good. Oh my. So you want to be a master of Pokemon? Do you have the skills to be number one? I want to be the very... Like, seriously, these gold butts are annoying so bad I'm forgetting the song itself. No, s s mm, leave me alone. 
Crap wads, I hate you all. Oh, hi, Groudon. Out of the two legendaries in this region, Groudon's probably my favorite one. And I really agree with that. I like Groudon a lot. That ain't good. We made it. We made it to where Groudon's gonna be. This ain't good. Trin changed into the magma suit. Trin fed the suit with the blue orb. That's a good thing. Uh oh. Oh! Hi there, Groudon! You wanna be friends? Hi! You can hear a voice from within the magma suit. Do you read me? It is I, the Great Maxi! A device built into that suit you have donned allows me to talk to you. We have received the readings from your suit. They suggest that Groudon has appeared. Is my, suge is my suggestion correct? Does it stand before you now? Yes, sir, it does. You must listen. Do not waste even a single second. Leap upon Groudon's mighty back. Then, then leap. Take you to... D. E. Uh. Th. G. That's not good. The sound cut out. This is not good. What's crazy is we had to get on top of Groudon's back in this game. Or Kyogre, depending on which one you're playing. I think it may be reason why my favorite just because Groudon's my favorite legendary. Out of the two. We'll use my favorite legendary of all time. This doesn't seem good, does it? He's about to go into primal reversion. Whoa, the entire the entire thing just went dark. Not until until on the bottom screen. I'll show you when I get the chance to. Let's wait. Because the thing lets me move. And I'll show you. Dude, look at this. That's so weird. That's cool at the same time, though. Cool detail. I don't even have to call it detail. It's, like, dangerous looking to me. Hi, Groudon. This ain't good. He's about to go into Primal Groudon. I think. Yep, he is. Oh, no. Oh, no. This ain't good. This is not good. This is so not good. Oh my. Oh no! What the heck? Oh my. Oh my good golly jeez whiskers. Yep, there he is. Oh hi hi Primal Ground on you wanna be friends now? Uh oh. I'm gonna challenge this thing, ain't I? On Oh crap it is! Primal Groudon has appeared! I could I have to battle him now. I could only have to, you know what? You know what? Hey, um, hey, Groudon, I got a solution to your problem here. You want to hear my solution? Is to go into my bag, go to my Pokeballs, find my Master Ball, and use it on you. Alright. Come on, Master Ball. If this fails, I will, I will, like, throw this out the window right now. Come on, Master Ball, catch this Groudon. One, two, three, boom! Didn't have to battle it. I just caught it in my Pokeball. Or my Master Ball, actually. We just caught Groudon. Yay! Probably one of my, 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 my favorite... Well, probably one of my favorite legendaries, actually. In, ter in terms of looks. 
Groudon, the continent Pokemon. Groudon is said to be the personification of the land itself. Legends tell of its many clashes against Kyogre, as each sought to gain the power of nature. Shall I name this thing Blaze? <laughs> Let's name Groudon Blaze, shall we? <laughs> kind of makes sense for him being kind of like the fire Pokemon. Fire version, anyway. I wonder if I can go back to see top and hit that Pokedex or do I have to beat the Gym off right to happen? Either way, we did it. We we got Grout on our side now. Oh my. It worked! We did! We b we got ground on! And we saved the world in this game! Yippee! We just got like happy too. I wonder if I can go to Professor Birch's now and get that. Now I can fall back to Zootopolis, I believe. Yeah! I'm still happy we did that, guys. I know we used the Master Ball, but it's better than just risking anything bad happening, you know? Oh, gosh! I need to move Waterfall, too! Well, what's like... What's like, I am going to take Wadius out of my party, because he might be the only slave I can use it. That sounded really bad. The only HM slave. That may be bad. Because if he's the... I'll have to use him to get up the waterfall if, that's, if it lets me. Otherwise, I'm kind of out of luck here, man. Luckily, I want to try catching an axe you later, so... We did it! Triton! It's really over, isn't it? Triton, we owe you great thanks. Look above you. The Skyvers who top us has returned to normal. Somehow, it's so warm! It's the energy that had been amused deep within the cave of origin now flowing out to pour over the greater world. It's as if the uncertainty and fear from moments ago never even existed. My heart feels like it's been softly set at ease. The sea or the land? Pokemon or humanity? All this time we've just been trying to grab onto happiness for one of them, even if it meant destroying the other. Look at how things have turned out. Now the world's got its natural balance back. We've got to rethink the thing from the very start. We've got to redo everything we've done from scratch and get it right this time. What do you say, Maxi? I suppose you may be right. However, personally in my case, some roads cannot be a time for, no matter how you try to write them. And I have committed a wrong so great as to bring the whole world to its knees. It may be that I... It may be too much to assume that I should deserve the chance to start anything over. Leader, without a doubt, you have committed an offensive that can never be forgiven. You have wronged not only Team Magma, but all living things on this planet. Whether great or small. However... That is precisely why you must now set things right. You must continue to atone for the sins you have committed, even at the risk of your own life. To set right the wrongs you've done without running away in fear. Isn't that how an adult accepts responsibility? Should you find the resolve to do so inside yourself, then I, Team Magma Admin Tabitha, 
I will serve at your side as counsel for it counsel forever. T Tabitha? Thank you. You know, someday we adults are gonna have to hand this world off to this little scamp and the rest of his generation. But what kind of world are we adults gonna make? What kind of world do we wanna to pass to these kids? If we haven't even figured that out in ourselves, we knew you. We never gonna get anywhere. So are we gonna make a world where everyone can kinda coexist together? Or after all, is it gonna be a world that we claim by force? One that we fight and scrabble over? I don't know, but I think we can at least start by giving it some time and thinking it over. All of us can do that, whether we're Team Aqua, or Team Magma, or whatever. You were able to use that blue orb to great effect, so I imagine you will also be able to handle this. Have ground on hold it, and you should be able to control its primal reversion for at least a short period, such as during a battle. I've got to get the red right underground on. And that's it for me. Later, Scamp. Farewell. Farewell. Team Mab and Team Aqua are made up of people with completely opposing ideals and goals. But perhaps even they can learn to meet halfway. One small concession at a time. I know it's too much to expect that everything will change at once, but I hope this crosses might at least help them take that first final step forward. I imagine that many changes are happening now all across Hoenn. I hope you will be able to travel this world and see its richness with your own eyes, and re renew in its new, reveal it in its newness in your own heart. But for the present. You must first wish to challenge the city's Pokemon gym. There you'll find the very same Wallace who helped us so much waiting for you. He's strong, but the way you are now, you should be capable of bowing him on equal footing. And when you travel the world, you should try to use this. This flute is one of my favorite items. Eon Flute. This Eon Flute is proof of the bond between you and your Latios. No matter how far you may be from one another, play that flute and Latios will surely fly straight to you. Then it can take to the sky, soaring above the land with you astride its back. Yes, just like when we first encountered Latios and Latios, Latios and Latios at Southern Island. People, Pokemon, Nature itself. Our survival in this world depends on all of us living together in harmony. I feel I have just begun to understand that, and I'm wondering how the world will continue to change from this point on. It fills me with an inexpectable excitement. Triton, as you and your Pokemon live and grow in this changed world, I wonder what effect it will have on you. What will you think about? What ideals will you believe in? If we do get the chance to meet again, I hope you will be able to show me and my team the answers you've found. Until then... Whew! Finally, it's just the two of us again. I've got to say, thanks for everything you've done for our region, Trenton. You know, I thought we were supposed to have set off a little route together, but... But you, Trenton, it seems like you just keep getting further and further ahead of me. I even started to feel like you've gone somewhere that I can't even reach. It's pretty lonely, you know. Not! What do you think if I really said something like that? <laughs> anyway, you did something really amazing today. So try to take it easy for a while. See you later. Bye, May. We got Growl on our side, baby! Yeah! Growled on, growled on. Probably my second favorite legendary in the entire game. Really, I think Growl is probably my second favorite legendary in any in any Pokemon game. Not joking. Lugia being number one, I think Growl on being number two. I like Growl on. No, he ain't my number one favorite. My first thing to do, if allowed, I'm gonna see if I can fly back. I'm gonna fly back to Little Root. Like, a, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to get the National Pokedex now. I don't know if it's going to allow me to. 
I don't know if it's gonna allow me to um do that. Get the national poet, but I'm at least gonna I'm, I'm at least gonna try. Let's fly back. Hopefully, let me fly back to Sutopolis. I need to train. I need to get back. I need to go to Wallace too. Is this my house? I think it is. Yeah, it is. Hey, mom, you hear my Pokemon? Oh, did Dad give you that badge? And here's something for your mom. Amulet coin. It's a wonderful thing to try harder your passion. But don't push yourself too hard, dear. You can always come home if you need to. Good luck, honey. Here my Pokemon. You feel okay, Trenton? You look a little tired. I think you should rest a bit. Yeah. Poor have been healed. Now take care out there, honey. Come on, Birch. Give me that national debt. Now. Please. I will give you money. <sighs> give me the national debt. 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 Sorry, give me the national debt. Please, please, please. Welcome back, Trenton. You must be tired for all your recent exploits. May has been keeping up me updated about all of your grand adventures around Hoenn. After hearing all that you've been up to, there is something I'd definitely like to share with you. The fact of the matter is that after you resolve that couple with the super agent Pokemon, a number of Pokemon never ever recorded in Ho the Hoenn region began to appear all over. Those Pokemon are precisely the subject of my many long years of research. They are Pokemon which are thought to have re resided in Hoenn thousands of years ago. Well, if I will be able to meet Pokemon never, ever before seen, the very Pokemon I've pursued all these years. I'm so excited I feel like I'm about to burst. So excited that I went, went right ahead and upgraded the Pokedex to be ready for all of them. Now, let me upgrade your Pokedex while you're here. The National Pokedex, baby! Oh, yeah! I can catch an axe here. I can catch an axe here now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I finally have, I finally have my final team member in my game. You'll now find the National Pokedex on your Pokedex menu, so it is being suggested that Hoenn is now more hospitable than, uh, than to Pokemon after that incident in Cetopolis. However, that does not necessarily mean the environment has become any more hospitable to humanity. People, Pokemon, and nature, the balance between these three great ecosystems has shifted greatly. I can't wait for you to start exploring this new world. Exploration may help us learn how best to coexist with Pokemon from this time forward. I hope you will find your own answers to this great question as you continue your journey with your Pokemon. Okay, guys, our next step is to fly to Duford. We can catch an Axew, I think now. Yippee ki yay! Professor Birch is starting. Are you serious? You think by now he'd say something different because it's been long since he's. Wadios, fly me back to Duford. I need. Me and Axio on my team. <laughs> I need me an Axio. I need me an Axio. I need me an Axio. Where is there? I need to go again? It is. Do for do for do for. Where's do for again? Lily Cove. Moss Deep. That's who top was. Yeah. I can fly back there, so I don't have to worry about that. Four Tree. Oh, good God. Where is it? Rustboro. Fall Arbor, Lava Ridge, Verdant Turf, Mauville. Where is that one city again? I keep reading the name of the city. Duford. Oh, it's in the water in the corner. Yeah, there it is. I don't know why I didn't remember. I knew it was in the water, but I was thinking like I couldn't see it on the on the place I was looking, so I was like, uh, probably ain't there. I put on a button healed. So my next step is to get rid of Latios. Or not get rid of him, but put him in the box because he ain't gonna have no deposit Pokemon. Latios, I'm sorry, but you have too many HM moves. Deposit. Deposit. There we go. Now I have room to put Gra I'm gonna give Groudon love off camera, guys. And maybe if we have time during this episode, I'll go and do a little bit now. But I'm going to go and look for an Axie first. That means I want to do give two Pokemon some love. Alright, guys. Here's our chance. We can finally catch an Axie. I need to pull up the, I need to pull up the Poke Finder again. Okay. This is going to be great. 
kind of, that scared me a little bit. Uh, oh god, I hope it ain't like that one episode where we just sit there waiting for an hour for an at two. I hope Atsu shows up really quick. Let's go down one ladder. I can go down main. I'm going to go down this one. Then I'm going to walk up. Oh, crap. I can't use the move Flash. I may watch that top then. I don't know if this will get me in. I don't know if this will get me in that too up here or not. <sighs> That's an Abra. I want an Axew. An Axew. Axew, Axew, Axew. I love Axew. Come on. I want me an Axew on my team, please. Axew, 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 Axew. Come here, buddy. No, not you, whatever you are. No. <gasps> oh. That crap almost sound like. I was about to say. I was about to say. I was about to start apologizing. I was about to be like, oh, I'm so sorry for saying that. I was about even starting to kiss the screen because I was so upset about saying that. Well, that's you. That wouldn't know that's you. Dead gummit. That's it. That's an Abra, I bet. Mm -hmm. Agron keeps appearing for some reason. Agron, I keep saying Agron, that ain't quite the right evolution. Oh, I'm probably gonna spend the last 20 minutes of this game looking for an Atsu. Come on, I've got the National Pokedex. It said all I wanna do now is run around this area till I find one. I need to have a Pokedex, my Pokenab open though, so. Abra, you ugly piece of. You're not an Axew. Axew, Axew, Axew. I'm a man's cry. I just love Axew so much. I want my team so badly. I am about to hurt where Pornic shows up here. <clears throat> That's his wings. Gone. Screw you. You junk wad, I'm after an Axew, not you. You're not very important to me. An Axew is. I love Axew. That's not an Axew. I can hear it under cry. Yeah, Abra. Screw you, Abra. Do, 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 do. Oh, I want for Zubats in here. Oh, let's try using super. You know, I didn't even. That's why I saved the repel. Duh. I can actually walk around this area with that. I'm gonna get off my bike first. Now, I'm gonna go into my. Matt's repel. I only have one. But it'll be worth it if I find me an axe you. It'll be worth it. That's an Aaron. That cry I recognize. Yep, Aaron. You're not the one I wanted. Alright. That probably ain't no Axie either, but I don't know what it is. Yep, Makuhita, get out of here. Come on, man, with the National Pokedex, don't do this to me. Up here for me, Axew. Please. You want money? Love? Because I'll give a little I'll give all the one I have on my team a lot. They're Aaron. And right now it's the crowd. Turn around what Axew's cross sounds like. I sit here and wait for something up here where I don't waste all my repel. This is the only one I've got, and if I waste it, I have to go buy more. Yeah, 
whatever. Yep. Where is an Atsu when you need one? I get up to the surface because I don't have the move flash on my area now. I've seen somebody find Atsu up here. It's just probably not going to be as common. Come on, Atsu, please. Why is it still hard to find Atsu? Oh crap. Uh, I'm going to Come on, Atsu, please. <sighs> Screw you, Abra. Mine's gonna run the heck away before I punch this thing in the eyeballs. I don't wanna punch the Abra in the eyeballs, but don't leave me alone. I've seen somebody literally catch an Abra about where I'm, or not an Abra. I've seen somebody literally catch like an Atsu about where I'm standing. You only a few feet away from this ladder. I guess where the repel is a little more common because of the fact that like, you're more rare on a party or whenever they're eating. I'm going to knock you out and make you stew in a minute. I'm not really about to go to the store to buy repels. I don't want to do it, but if I have to get an Atsu, I'll do it. Not many, just like five. They know at they know I'm gonna say they know Axie in this town. They know Pokemon in this town. Dang it! Oh Zuba, you ugly piece of crap. I wanna rip your wings off, I swear it. I got growled on, but now the only thing I need in my team to be complete is Dagomatsu. I want to have to at least one of my games, guys. Can the game be nice and give me a free Axu? It won't. The game hates me, that's for sure. Yeah, I'll scare one off, it appears. I'm scared of Axu, I scare one off, like if one just appears out of nowhere. I swear to you, I would kill you. <laughs> Ask you, buddy, come here. I don't want to fly all the way to that gum. I count as an actual store. I, that's like flying back and forth for no reason, just to buy repels. Well, not no reason, but.
Let's see, what's a town that actually had? Ah! I got rid of the guy knows for. Oh my god. I can go back in game, but I really don't want to. I just want to ask you. It's all I'm asking for in this game is an ask you. Why is he even having to be so mean to not give me one? The only thing a video of every video of what says to do is the dead gum. Run around in this area till a like, little oh, shadow appears. And then, like, if it's a dragon type, it almost would be asked to you. If there was an Axie, you probably would have just scared off. I don't know, if you would have popped up name sooner, you probably could have been a part of my team, but you never popped up anytime sooner than this, so sh screw you, bye. It'd be too late to race him, and I'm uh, scared of What did I just run into? I can just run to the Abra. Nope, and I run. And why does the game hate me? I think I went to Bavilla and Lost as you can always just run into them by um running in the running this area until you either run into a wild one or dead gum. <gasps> no! They know it's an axe you! I'm getting off the bike. I just lost my axe you. I was lost my axe you! I think that was an axe you, that was a different cry! Oh no! Screw you, Abra, screw you, screw you, screw you! I'm, I'm going to rip you apart if you don't go away. I just want this axe you, I just lost. Dang it! Well, I hate riding my bike. Come on, axe you, reappear. That was a cry, you dang piece of crap! Aaron, you will. I'm going to. You lucky I like you, Aaron. Or you would be getting so many threats right now. I don't want to slide for you. Only you. And you and Aaron don't you getting passes on on threats? Cause like, I'm going to do something to some. That's an Aaron. Ain't what I need. Screw him. Screw him. I can't believe I just probably just had an you in my grasp and I accidentally just lost him. Now they're actually going to go up here for me, is it? Or another one. I'm serious. I'm ready to take that Aber and throw it at, and throw it at the wall of the cave. Because all I want is an Axie when none of that's happening. And these Waffle won't leave me alone. I want to see if I can get one up here. I don't want to fly back to a town, guys, but I'm trying not to waste time on this video. I want to have an active in this video. I want to have one on the video, not just in it. So you can't blame me for doing this. I want to make an entertaining video for all of you. Of course, you'll probably entertain anyway because I'm yelling a lot, and so that seems to make y'all laugh, probably. So yeah, you're probably still enjoying this part of the video, but they're not going really be happening. I think we're killing out and see what our Pokemon this is. Just casually click the run button. Just casually click the run button. There. Piece of crap, I hate him. I just heard a different cry a while ago. And now I'd say I'm run away. That was probably an axe to you. I looked up his crowd multiple times yesterday, I forgot what it sounds like already, this is why it's... Only what I remember is like, ah, the one that he does.
That's not, that's a moth heat it, right? Yep. Screw you. Casually walk in the cave. Axe you! Axe you! Axe you! I'm trying to do his voice, I can't do it. Axe you! Axe you! I can't remember what the anime sounds like. What's wrong from the, from the game sound? Dang it. I'm about to just fly back to a town and literally just do it. I, I, no matter what, I'm one Axe you. I'm not ending this. I'm not leaving this game until either my battery dies or I find one. I mean that, literally. I'm gonna try one more encounter. If I don't find one, I'm gonna go back to the. I'm gonna find a place for the market. Okay, I'm going back to a place for the market. I also might know dig right. No, I don't. I may swamp or forget that. Dang it. I'm gonna say if I swear you did, I just wouldn't get out of this game without worrying about anything. <laughs> See about blocking the entrance? I'm ready to literally knock you out into. Oh my gosh, if I could say what I wanted to say, you you would get the worst threat you've heard in your life. <sighs> I don't want to ask you, and I will find me one now. What am I doing? <coughs> what a mm. I'm gonna fly back to a place as Town does have one, okay. <laughs> Here we go. I want you to go and buy something, you guys, this time. Where you don't have any white dag. Okay. It costs only 700. I'm gonna buy five. If five ain't enough, there's something wrong. Of course, like I said, it actually does not appear very easily. I could probably said they're gonna use all five repels. That's like equal. It takes 250. So 250 plus 250 is 500 then. 750. So I got 1,250 1, steps in order to find me an axe to you. If I don't find it in that time, well that's it. I don't have to go back and... I'm going to fly back to Dagum. And I'm going to fly back to Duford again. Alright, come on Lottius.
then bike, 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 all the way through whatever that was. I'm gonna use. I'm, I'm actually try using two, one or two of the repels in here, and like one in here, and one in the dark area down there, and one in here, so on and so forth. I'm gonna try again without one first. Not long, but we're trouble. But watch, I'll find out to you randomly now. Just watch, I will like run the one. I could swore her another cryer when I was like actually rub my bike over it, so I was like about to ask I just lost it. I might want to get my bike just in case. I'm gonna go ahead and use one in here. Now I don't waste my time sitting here waiting for an annoying piece of craps. There are five of them. Yeah, G, dude. I'm doing this maybe that way if a walk one does appear, it won't, I won't scare it off so you can actually get a wall ago. That's definitely not what I'm looking for, but it does sound like a different cry. No one ain't. It's a Makuhita. I want some interesting game. An Axie, for instance. An Axie would be nice. Please. Before I go cuckoo. <gasps> that might be him. It's an Axie! We found it! Oh, for the love of God, stay there! Stay there! Stay there! Oh, God! Oh God, stay there, stay there, please. <gasps> Ow. 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 Oh. 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 It's an you. It's an ad. Oh, I'm on my brief. I gotta get a moment to breathe. dream has come true if I could catch it. Oh, Atsy, if you can hear me, please calm to me. Do not run. <sighs> Hold on, guys. I think I'm going to catch my breath here. I've got to think. I'm going to try throwing a pug wire. I don't want to hurt it. I want to catch it without hurting it. That way I don't actually knock it out. Because this Pokemon is going to be hard to... I'm going to have to use an Ultra Ball on this thing. I don't have to use a Premier Ball, but I don't think it's going to work out without hurting it a little bit. Use a great ball. Alright, great ball. Go! Catch us, ax you! Please! Please! One. No, no, no. Oh, please, ax you. I'll give you money not to run. Or just to. Please, ax you. You want money. I just want you. I want you on my team. That's all I want from you, buddy. Please, please, please. What's a netball do? That is more effective than a catch water or bug type of. Oh, that's he's a dragon. Dang it. Okay. Should we risk an ultra ball, guys? We only got one, but it's a, it's a great risk. Because if we don't catch this axe, y'all feel upset. 
I'm, I'm doing it. I don't care. If it's only one, I don't give a care. Atsu, please join my team. You want money? I'll give you that. Love? One? Two? Ah! <laughs> please, Atsu, just join me. Oh, for goodness sake, just join me. Don't do this to me. Don't turn me into a monkey. Oh, please, God. No, 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 no. <laughs> Don't run away from me. Don't run away from me. Don't run away from me. Don't run away. Don't run away. Don't run away. The lower the level of the wild Pokemon. We got two ne ne nest balls. Oh, it's only level 12. That becomes more effective the lower the level of the wild Pokemon. So will uh, level 12 Pokemon be good then? Let's risk one. I need. Come on. Please, God. Catch the Pokemon. One. Two. Three. Yeah. This episode's done. I'm, I'm, I'm going to like end it now. After I get out of the cave, I'm ending it, and then we'll face walls in the next episode. We can't ask you. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's see how great this one is throughout going. <laughs> okay. Ask you, the tusk Pokemon. They use their tusk to crush the berries they eat. Repeated regrowth makes their tusk strong and sharp. I kind of want to give this like a nickname, but I don't know anything good for a he for a hero, for a dragon. I might name it Hero, just because he's the best Pokemon in the entire game that I've just caught. I love all my Pokemon, especially Axew. Axew's going to get some special treatment from me in a little bit. It may not be on camera. Actually, I may do it on camera. Ooh, should I name it? Oh, that's the good question. Should I name this thing? I shouldn't call it a thing. I love you to death, Axie. I wish I could pet you right now. I wish I could just I should go up to it and pet it. It's so cute. <laughs> ah, we caught it. We caught this Axie. No way. No way. I can't believe it. I want to name it. I want to name it something, but I don't know what to name it. What's a good name for a dragon Pokemon Axie? Hmm. And you think a dragon type nickname would be good, but I don't want to name it. I could name it Slayer, but that sounds really bad. Slasher? Uh oh. That sounds cool. Slayer sounds like a cool name, but I'm scared that. To... I don't know, will Game Freak or will the. Will that game even accept that? Because I know that Game Freak don't like having some really bad words on there. I know Slayer ain't, but like, that could be a bad thing to be saying, like, come on, Slayer, I choose you! Slasher? That sounds no better. Dang it, it's only good, two good nicknames I can think of other than Hero. Ah, oh, I want to name this thing. Oh, Axie, you are the best Pokemon in the entire world. I love you to death. I'm on. It's a boy, Axie. Slayer, 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 Slayer. Yes, that's her name. That's her name. That's her name. <laughs> no, no, you're not going to bots. No, I'm getting you out of that now. Latios, get out of my party. You're gone. Nope. <laughs> Guys, we're going to get Axie out. We're petting him today. I ain't going to do it all on camera, but I'll do some of it right now, along with Groudon. I am, like, the happiest kid in the world right now. <laughs> That sounded weird. I saw some kind of weird monster now. No! Get the heck out of my face! No, no, no! Hey, hey! 
<laughs> we can't ask you. We can't ask you. We can't ask you. We can't ask you. Put one on the deposit. Put one on the deposit. No, no, no. Not you. Not you. Not you. You. You're gone. Love piece of chicken grease. You're out of here, man. I got an axe you that's more important. Axe you's amazing. <laughs> withdraw. Withdraw, Pokemon. <gasps> Guys, look at this. Whoa, he knows Scratch, Leer, Assurance, and Dragon Rage. That's awesome. The way I'm sounding sounds super weird, but see <laughs> I gotta see this act to you. I gotta see it. 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 I gotta see this cute little thing. Let me see it. Let me see it. Let me see it. Dang, that sounded crazy. Okay, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Swire. Hello. That sounds bad now that I say it out loud. Dang it. See what I mean? I gotta see him. <laughs> Moves can be used on the target regardless of its abilities. Oh. That's cool. Really? Nature has a rash nature and it likes to run. You can run all you want in my in my party, buddy. Just don't run away from me. Cause I love you to death. I'd probably like I'd probably be one of them owners where if I had like Kim as a pet, I'd be like Please don't run away. I'd probably like, I'd probably like crying for days for an Axew. Cause you don't know how long it's been stuck. I've never had Axew on my team. I've always loved him, but never really had one on my team. And the only game I can think of where you can really find one that's easy to find is in the X and Y. Cause it's like literally in a patch of grass somewhere later in the game. Like I think close to like some kind of town. I don't remember the name of it. San Jim Town. Not San Jim Town. That's in, in the center region. I don't know the name of town, but it was like this little patch of grass that's on a mountain area. And like you go through it and you can find different Pokemon, including I think Bagon and Axie in that same patch of grass. I've always got a Bagon though, because I want a Salmon as well. If I can't train up Axie so much, I might actually just go ahead and like... Oh boy. I'm going to give Groudon some love first, but it's always like I can save the best for last. Not joking. Atsu, you, you've won my heart over. I love you to death. There's the red orb. A shiny red orb that is said to have a legend tied to it. It's known to have a deep connection with the Hoenn region. I can give that to, um... Groudon. <laughs> no! There we go. <laughs> Let's take care of our while we're here too. You're hungry, so I'll feed you. Let's feed Swampert, guys. Hey, Swampert. We got an Axie on our team. How do you like that one, bud? That's awesome. Oh, gosh. I forgot I could hear me. Or he can hear me. Or is it a she? Now I'm getting them mixed up, see what I mean? I love Swamper to death, though. Like I said, I love all the members on my team now. I'm giving them all love right now, too. I love them all so much with all of my heart. No, my look, if one point said to jump out in front of a train, I probably thought you would do it. All right. I love a Pokemon to death, guys. You don't know how long. Let me tell you again, so where I'm, where you can't hear me. Um, it's been I've never had an Axie on my team. I found one I think before Nate some while, but didn't want it, so I already had a Bagon and they're like I was wanting a Bagon at the time. But I tell you this, if I known that they were gonna take this on to find another one, I probably wouldn't have done it. Either way, we found an Axie. Oh my gosh, I'm like so happy. I'm like the happiest kid in the world right now. Nothing can make me happier. 
Actually, you've made me look happy today. Thank you. We gave him some food like he wants. We'll give Eric all my coins some love, like I said. Alright, so we gave Swampert some love. Mighty Anna, your turn. You want some food, too. Alright, boy, here you go. Let's feed you. Hello, Mighty Anna. Here. Food for you. I can't believe it was still coming at you. I can't believe it. Mm -hmm. Camera Rock wants some food as well. Alright, Camera Rock, let's do this. Excuse me. Hi, Camera Rock. I love all of you. Mm hmm. This game is like really, maybe really unhappy, really happy today. I love this game. I just wish it didn't taste so on the fine axe so because now it's gonna take forever to train them up. Actually, it won't take forever. It'll just be like a handful because it won't be as many battles except for me to look forward. And we still got the episode to do, but like after that, the only thing left is like that bow tree thing. I don't know if that even trains a problem without putting them in there. I don't have really trains your Pokemon at all, actually. Which it ain't even a battle trade, just give it like the battle mansion or something like that. I'm gonna just get everything he wants. Growled on. Oh, good lord, he's gonna be big as crap. He's so big, he takes up two screens. Just imagine how scary this thing would be having to take care of this thing. I can't believe this game did this to me. I love this. I love this right now. Okay. Okay, he always be pair on the stomach. That's one of the places. I'll give you more off camera, buddy. That's amazing. Axew? How are you, bud? Me and boys are really close. I might actually like, do more than just that, but right now I want to pet this cute little Axew. He's like one of the cutest Pokemon I've ever seen in my entire life. I love that see the death. He's so cute. Oh, just look at how he eats and cheers too. He's like he's like happy no matter what. He's eating. He's like like really enjoying it. And then he jumps jumps up whenever he gets like, done and he's cheering. That's cute. I love that you so much. It's so cute. I love you. <laughs> I don't know why. 
You see what happens, guys? I catch Pokemon that I really love in the game, and it actually like makes me insanely happy. That's the thing about me. I could go to a really... I don't know if you know... Actually, I think you do, because you see my, um... My, um... Pokemon talk. M my own series on that. Where I would be a total toad out of that. Like, I have the same problem he does, where... You know, I can get really happy or really angry easily, that kind of thing. That's the thing about me, especially in games like this, because if... If I could catch a Pokemon I really like, for example, I will be, like, the giddiest person, like, the rest of the day. Like, one of the happiest people you'll ever meet. So, same thing can happen, like, if I'm angry, though. If something makes me mad or, like, upset, then I, that'll probably be my mood the entire day. Or at least until, like, you know, at least until, like, like, for a few hours, definitely. It won't just last for about an hour. It'll last more than that. Oh. Actually, it's so cute! You want one? Hi! Hi, Axie! Did he just wave at me? I said hi, Axie, and he did like this little. with both his hands. That was kind of cute. Or, I only have to go my hands. Little arms? I wonder if you all do that if you respond to him. He's cute as crap, though. I love him. <laughs> okay. As you screwed me, I thought I'd say I'm mad. Okay, he writes on the belly. It's so cute. Just look at him, guys. Look at that happy dude. I don't know if I want to play with him on camera or not, but I would love to, actually. I need to do it with both Groudon and him, though, so it's going to be a lot of work. But who cares? It'll be all worth it for this little guy to like me. All worth it. I'd love to have a hatchet spot in this game as well. Oh, he's so cute. Just look at him. Oh, oh, this... This better save. Because this video was all worth... You know what, guys? This video's over. I mean it. Me and Slayer are looking close. See, that sounds bad now. But that's a cute little name for him. I love that name. It's so cute. This game better say because I... I... Okay, it says we're in Duford. Are we in Duford? You know what we'll do? We'll fly back to Sutopolis because that's where we need to go next. I'm going to go and fly to it. Oh shoot, I don't have the fly Pokemon. Yeah, we'll save right here then. Anyway, guys, we can't ask you in this video. Very worth it. See you for the next one. Everyone get to take on the Elite Four and Champion.